Morning, morning. I've just made some discovery. I've just found I've just found a document. It's the, the same ones I've been stacking away. That's got clearly it's got Tekuri, Kaipara District, twenty fourth of December eighteen sixty, deeds number one six five, and it links Huri Tekuri to Refrefa Manaka. Right here, deeds on a on a land block that joins I'm just writing it in my book. The this deed is written on this twenty fourth day of December in the year of our Lord eighteen sixty is the full and final conveyance and surrender by we the chiefs and people of the tribe of Wai Ruhe or Terarawa. Hang on, I'll just make this bigger so I can see. So I can read. Hang on. Now, I'm just going to say these words so you can hear it. The chiefs and the people of the tribe of Waiaruhe Te Rarawa Te Kawa Te Kawe Wahie, whose names are here unto subscribed and witness that on behalf of ourselves, our relatives and descendants, we have by signing this deed under the shining sun of this day parted with and for ever transferred unto Victoria Queen of England her heirs and kings and queens who may succeed to her and assigns the sum of 620 pounds. Um, yeah, so this is on this kite book. It was, oh hang on, I'm going to read this a little bit. I'm just going down a little bit. And we hereby acknowledge the receipt of the said monies, all that parcel of land situated at Kaipara and named Te Kuri, right? The boundaries whereof are set forth at the foot of this deed and a plan of which land is annexed thereto with its trees, minerals, waters, rivers, lakes, streams, that's what I wanted here, and all appertaining to the said land or beneath the surface of the said land and all our right title claim and interest whatsoever thereon to hold to the Queen Victoria her heirs and the signs as lasting possessions absolutely forever and ever. Now that's the part I'm sticking to the British Empire right now in these titles to the kings, right? And you just heard me say Te Kuri, land is running from Te Rarua, right up where you are, down to the Kaipara, that's where the courthouse was, where Refa Refa Manukau to Auckland to Waikara was joined. You see, I put these documents aside, and I've just gone right over them to find this bit. And there it is, the proof in the pudding here, and it's got here in big bold, 1860, 24th of December, and then underneath that in capitals, Kaipara District, and under that in capital letters, Te Kuri. Dear mate, so he owned more than just a little block of land. In fact, the whole of North, right down to Kaipara, and from Kaipara onwards, it was Refa Refa Manukau. Dear, I've nailed it. I've, I've, I've nailed it, and this is the old documents, the deeds. This is the deeds. That's why they won't do anything with you, because you're holding on to this decory deeds. These fellows are really stuffed now, and it's got the names on here. John Rogan. DC, uh, District Court, John Rogan. That's in Helensville, like how I was saying, our all bank. You see, you see? Now, we've got Tomai Rangi in capitals, Nga Hiraka in capitals, and Manako in capitals. Those three to this transaction. There. And it's got underneath the, where, 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 where they've signed, the Manukau, there's to, Tomai Rangi and Nga Hiraka and Manukau signed and it's got underneath that Nga Ka Titiro, A.S. Atkinson of Taranaki Farmer, S. Percy Smith Government Survey, Surveyor, K. 
Kaipara district. You know the fellow Lockwood Smith? You heard of that fellow's name? Lockwood Smith? Yeah. Yeah, he's the, he's the speaker of the house before, right? And and he's in London now. But he, he's he got all the land that Mohi Manukau said. You see all that land over there with this uh, up uh, uh, Rogan's Hill, right? Rogan's Hill, going to uh, Dargaville from, uh, from the main road, going up north on the main road, up that yeah. way, uh, Rogan's Hill. Uh, there, there, there. Over there, all that land blocks over there is Lockwood Smith, and there he's 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 gone and succeeded to these these Percy Smith. You see, government surveyor. That was the surveyor of Kaipara district. That's why he. That's why Lockwood Smith landed up with all those lands up there in 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 Dunville. So you see now, Kori, it was a big area. He's right from the north tip up north. Down, down to the Kaiparas, to the courthouse, and from the courthouse onwards, back, right back down the other way, is the Rewa Rewa Manukau. There, that's it. We've got the right three chiefs. Hori Tikuri, Rewa Rewa Manukau, and Te Rewaikato Wharehere Here in Manukau. See? Yeah, that's, I'm telling the truth. It's, it's right there. But I had all these stacked up. All I keep doing is stacking up, putting away, putting away, putting away. But I went to investigate. All my documents. I've gone through each one in my files on my, my my computer to find what's missing, and there it is. I've got. I've just put it on Facebook actually, so people can see. There's this thing about Nati Kuri up there is all bullshit, mate. It's you. <laughs> They're all bullshit up there. Nati Kuri is all bullshit. Yeah, that's why. That's why Bundy's. That's why Bundy's. Oh, that's their own way of interpreting it. And that's why Bundy is, is claimed Waikato. Right? He says Waikato comes from up there. No, Waikato comes down from Mangatauri Mountain. And, and the Pohara Pa and the Pohara Marae, where my father-in-law lives, that's his family there, right at the bottom of the, the base of the Mangatauri Hill, that's the main Marae. Not the not the Manga Totori Marae they got there. Tainui put that there. Oh, yeah. You see, they've switched it all around. Now I'm going to bang this right in their face. On 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 the next on the next um, uh, hearing. You see, the kuri, the kuri, the te kuri here is in black and white, mate. It's in black and white. Nobody's going to claim it. They don't know how to do it. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Bloody hell. <laughs> I've got it here in black and white, mate. <laughs> Goody, right there in capital. All those names in capitals are the commercial landowners. Yeah. They're the, they're the, and when they when they arrested me, that's why I'm using my 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 shirt. And when the, my stuff came back from the the prison, uh, from from the prison in in. Uh, uh, police station, uh, and you got the packet with the shirt and everything in it, my belongings, but it's got Wano and capitals, so I stuck the Wano beside those fellows, those chiefs, and say, I'm one of them. <laughs> See? Cool. That's, that's real cool, man. If you had a hooey with this, it would blow them right out. And with Mora's book on top of it, it, it would blow their, all their fuck up puppets to smithereens. This one would, at least, because they're not talking like this. They were all claiming Nati Kuri, but there was na no, th there's no Nati Kuri in here. It's only Te Kuri. You see? Yeah, yeah, it, that's yeah. 1860. Just before 1862, when they brought in the Native Land Act with Refa Refa Manukau. Right there. Right there. 1860 here. So you, you base your Te Kuri on 1862 to your today's one from 1882, but there it is, 1860, a piece of land was sold right from Te Rarawa, up that way, down to Kaipara. All that stretch of land. There's, there's the sale and purchase agreement right there. You had to be in a real estate, that's why I've been in real estate before, to know what, what a document is. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Otherwise, that's true. otherwise nobody would know, because... Uh, it would be confusing while well, it would be something they don't want to know about. 
that's why they say, oh, we don't want to know about history or anything like that. You see? But there it is. That's, that there, stuck in front of everybody's nose up in Waitangi, would not know how to handle it. They would, somebody will get wild and take their, their patu and go and hit somebody. <laughs> I can see all the frustration up there now when they see this one go on Facebook. I've got them there on Facebook, but I haven't explained it. Those, those uh, you know those old documents, the deeds documents, that every now and again you see them, like your ones, but this, this is being more specific. It's got the sale and purchase and the amount that sold it for. See, you'll, you'll see those in the old treaty settlements, but you have to go to the Victoria University on, online to find them because they do publish them, and that's why I've gone to the Victoria University uh, to get it. So that's how good news, that's good news for us. And I can just cite that, cite that, get it apostolized, that document, or those four documents, with Te Kuri right on it and Manukau. The, the Manukau Sale and Purchase Agreement of Pukitoi, right? That was just one of the land blocks. But the Pukekohe land, well, the Pukekohe area was, the Puke is up on Bombay Hills, right? That's the Puke. And then the land stretches down to uh, Cleveland, right right through there to Waiuku on the other side, where these fellows are. Where the Minhinics and, 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 and uh, Willie Pater and them are sitting on that land, guarding that Tikuri and their Refer Refer title for themselves. See? <laughs> <laughs> They're getting a bit witty witty now. <laughs> Mr. Morris <laughs> is sitting on the Mona <laughs> and I'm sitting on the other Mona in, in, in Waikato. Because those Manukau's, those Manukau's uh, that I spoke to down there, I said, you, you want to just sit there and wait. Yeah? I'll do all the talking. Because <laughs> they're shy. You see? The, the real honest ones are shy. They don't want to talk about it. It's too grueling because they've lost too much to Tainui. Yeah. Tainui in the crown. The Tainui in the crown took over and put everything naughty all over it. See, they, 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 they burnt down everything. Burnt down the Marae up where, it's, where, where it was originally up on top of the hill and then built one on the flats. Not far from um, um, Cambridge. So that the crown owns the Marae. See? You might as well say the Crown's running all the Marais. There's nothing you can do about it because they're the ones that are running them with their Maoris. And one Maori got caught. <laughs> uh, Peter Peroni got caught. <laughs> now, now this is going to sink them all. I'm glad I found it because I thought, shucks, there's something missing. I better go and have a look through all my documents. There's thousands and tons of documents. And I get lost in my own documents. But that's, that's, that's good news for you, because it puts Tikuri right over the top of everything from Te Reringa Wairua right down to Kaipara Courthouse, Awaroa Native Court in, in Helensville. That's where I've been doing all my work, with Mui Manukau, there, and, and going over all these things. Yeah, for, for, for six years I stayed there. I lived there. Lived, actually, get it. Abandoned my, my house and went to, in the Remura. I was living up there. Well, I was paying the rent in, in Remura. Well, it was my daughter's place anyway. She let me rent it. And, uh, but I went up and stayed with uh, Mohi Manako and his brother <coughs> in, in, uh, in the 10 acre block where they started cutting up the 10 acre blocks out of the big blocks. That's where the 10 acre block came from, where they got 10 owners. Right? And, and, and cut down. That's where they did the model, right there. And, we, and I've got all the things to get that 10 acre block back. And, and, and all, the, all the land back from that. And I've, I've put enough time in that trying to get it all back. But if there was something missing, this was it here, right here. But that's, you know, that's, that's, that's uh, university stuff. That, that's uh, the masters, where they get the masters degrees from to do these things. And, and put titles on things. But there you are, Te Kuri in black and white. 
not Nazi, not Nazi, but in capitals, particularly. Everything in capitals, that's commercial. Well, well, that may now that um, the world runners should do. Since you've been doing all these investigations mm. and all that, but now this, um, the Christian name is starting to come on again. It is, it is right up there in, in how they did it, how the Crown did it here in Australia, but it's still like this. This is what I read into now. Although the Australian uh, um, Crown agents put the titles on the land, they really thought they owned it, right? And the British said, no, you haven't got a license from us. And that's the part I've seen. I've, I've got that out now. But the British says, no, you haven't got a license. You have to be... You, you have to get a license from us, and that's still right now, like now. That's why the, the Crown in Wellington is still trying to settle their own contract without the Crown's license of Britain. They're trying to use the New Zealand, New South Wales license, right? That's, that's Peter Peroni in them, and all those uh, trustees and all, all the the Iwi, I, Iwi Trusts are trying to settle themselves without the British and using the British name. See, but these titles here, they go straight back to, to England through Queen Victoria and back when, when, when the Queen abandoned and went into EU Parliament, it just defaults back to the last king. See, it goes back, it goes, it defaults, that's what I'm doing, default, the contract by default between Horitikuri and Refa Refa Manika and uh, uh, John Rogan, this John Rogan did your one too, they've got, they've got it there, John Rogan, it's named there, John Rogan, D.C., District Court in Helensville, now that was, that, they married Manukau's and married my family down the East Coast on, on these native land titles. That's why Bundy and them are very weary of what I'm saying about John Rogan. There it is. He's got your te, te kuri on it. Nothing about Nati. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's even got the amount. 361... 651 pounds. Yeah, yeah. So, so that, that's for all that area. Six, 651 pounds. That's how much those chiefs got. To my rangi, to my rangi. Not to my rangi, to my rangi. Na Hiraka and Manukau. Those three chiefs. Uh, 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 sold the land to John Rogan. John Rogan was from Australia, but they were operating from Australia, and the British said, "No, you haven't got a license." See? Hey, you know, um, not just next Friday. Yeah, next Friday. Why? Um, how long is it? Where's your uncle? Oh, not long. Why, is there something on? I can always change it. No. I, I've, only got to, I've, only got to, I've only got to do the same thing I did before. Just read the thing out. We don't, you don't have to tell you anything, No. I've already asked um, um, uh, Annette that I only wanted it to make, uh, make a visual uh, uh, a hearing. And that's it. You only need about a couple of hours. Not even an hour. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's all right. Okay. Yeah, now I'm going to come back with you. Yeah, I'll come back with you. Um, because I want. Yeah, I am going. To, I am going. I'm going to Yeah, so you don't. 
Yeah, you know, I can even come up on oh, no. <laughs> the beats the singer. I was going to say, I can come up and get you to come and get me. <laughs> nah, nah, that's all right. Um, uh, nah, nah uh, I could have saved the trouble and just come up on the bus. No, 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 Oh, sorry, sorry, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 no, nah, that's all right. Yeah, I'll, I'll... <laughs> Yeah, then we go. No, we go straight back up. No, I, 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 I'm only making a. I'm only. Yeah, straight away because I'm just making a. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm only making a. Yeah. Yeah, but when you. Yeah. So all you have to do when you come down is pull up and have a sleep on the side of the road every now and again. Have a rest and then carry on. That's what I do. No, 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 I'm coming straight through. I'm not Oh, okay, okay. So. Yeah. Well, what time is it? 10 o'clock. Oh, no, that's all good. I can even get the 5 o'clock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Four, 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 four o'clock. If, if you leave, even 5 o'clock is alright. It's only 3 hours, 3 and a half, and 3 hours on your car. And then I'll come around and pick you up at 2 hours. Yeah, yeah, just come straight to my house and... and yeah, I'll come to my house, I know Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, I'll come straight to you. Yeah, it's... it's yeah, we'll go from here and I'll get to the meeting. You know if Diane is going to go? Hey? Diane, over here. Are there anybody else going to go? No, we don't feel worried about who turns up, I'm just making statements. Do I know who's going to go? Yeah. From where? From your family, the other ones. Not as though they, they don't need to go, they, they're watching anyway, but there's no need for anybody to go. Yeah, no, don't, don't worry, because she already knows, but if she turns up, she turns up, because she doesn't, it doesn't matter. Uh, because, well, as long as we've got a, a, a few there, you know, it doesn't have to be, but, uh, and it will be there anyway, so, so as long as I get a small crew, and, and my mate Dion will be there and his wife, so that's enough to, to constitute a meeting, uh, but it's just to make a statement. After I take these documents to the to the uh, the lawyer to to seal, uh, and, and then I'm doing them today now. Um, but I just wanted to find this other bit, any other bits, the main important bits to do. Uh, uh, yeah. So no, that's all right. There's no need for for uh, anybody else to come. Uh, yeah. Just. just but just, just tell her, it's just, it's just, she only needs a couple of hours or even an hour uh, from work from 10 o'clock to 11 o'clock or 10 to 12 o'clock. It's from, I've advertised from 10 to 12 o'clock. The, the, the hui for, uh, and, and that's all. Yeah, that's all. We just uh, have a cup of tea and, and a couple of scones and that's about all. Yeah, and then we can just go sit. I'll have my gear to come and pick me up my, my, my bag and stuff and to go up there so I can, my computer so I can carry on doing bits of work up there. But I'll run through the other stuff with you with the model and all that. Um, so now that you heard me say about the minerals and the water on that document, on the deed, so uh, all I'm doing is going with the British Empire because that's where Donald Trump and all the rest of them are trying, and the Queen is trying to muscle their way back into Britain again. They're trying to hightail it back into Britain, into the safety of Britain, and but I'm saying no, we're going, we're we're already done this, and uh, that I'm going to use this argument, the British Empire, for the whole of where the flag is gone, to claim the flag, and all of this lot. See, it, it's it's uh, I've put a lot of stuff on Facebook and on YouTube, just letting the, letting them know what we're going to do. So as far as I'm concerned, we're putting this history right back and putting it in front of everybody here and telling them this is where we're going. You see? It's still a, it's still a who's who. Who, who are they and who, who we are. That's basically what, where's your title? Who, who, who you are down in Wellington. You see? Yeah. Don't come near us. Don't, don't come and interfere with what we're doing. So there you go. Uh, no. Yeah. Well, you know,
Oh, no, well, I think there'll be a lot of interest in, in, in what's happening here because they're just, they're just asking a lot of questions, that's all. You'll, you'll find a lot of people asking questions. Is that right or what, what's happened? Well, where are we going? Where, where is everybody going from now on? You see, at the moment, they don't know where they're going. They don't know where, what, what's in the future for them. You see? I'm, I'm, talking, about, I'm, I'm talking about the hapu. That they've got an uncertain direction. They only, they only have to follow what the Crown says. And, and just keep paying up and losing some more land. Uh, except, except Mr. Morris. <laughs> <laughs> See? So, but I'll be going over all these things with you up there anyway with the, with the mobile phone. I'm hoping it should be here this week. It's taking a bit of a long time, but I'm hoping that it'll be here this week so I can bring it up uh, and go with, over it with you up there. Yeah, well, I, I, I haven't done um, that too, but I'm sort of feeling that I'm going to Yeah, yeah. So, so anyway, if if no one turns up, um, then we'll just I'll just do it when I come up. It's not too far away. It's no no big deal. But I'll I'll, I'll hook it all up. I'll bring an, I'll, I'll get your computer, and bring that up as well, so that it's a desktop there as well, because that's cheap enough to get. So I'll I'll pick one up and, and bring it up. Um, we'll 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 go down and pick it up. <coughs> um, and and so I'll set that up. I'll set that one up for you to hook straight into that Wi-Fi instead of playing around with little little buttons on your phone. You can sit on the computer and do it on on, on, on the keyboard, right? And drive your things there. I'll, I'll make it so that it's easy for you to go straight into things. <coughs> I mean, it's just like watching Xbox or or Blimmin video game. Yeah, it, it's just you just push button and the game comes up. That's that's what I'm. What you can do with this, you don't have to know A, B, C, and D, and Z. Yeah, like the news, you want the news, you just push the news one, and and all the news comes up, all that sort of thing. So, so it's you need it because you can see what's going on. You don't don't have to go and buy a paper or listen to the radio. It's all in front of you, and and you can see what I'm doing, and I can see your face. To you see if you're. Oh yeah. <laughs> he he will be confused. I think they're still locked in, the, in in a different path than the one they should be watching in, in the history, in the whakapapa, that is, if he only knew his own whakapapa, he's stronger than the one they're looking at, right? Yeah. For a woman, that woman we would be Tira Wakato. They made made that chief in, into a woman. Tira Wakato for the head Manukau. They turned his name, his first name, Tira Wakato, into a woman. That's the woman he's talking about. That's all those whakapapas up there, Tororoa. All those whakapapas, Tororoa, Tekawa, Natikawa, uh, Natikahu, uh, Teoriaho. All those whakapapas come out of that Tira Wakato woman. That they made it up. They made it up, and that's, that, that, they're going to cry at the end of the day when they're, they're going to hit somebody over the head. For, for well, no, they must have got one to sing on the Facebook. We need to go over the world with the Bahati, the interest, and it's going to bring out a lot of different people, and different people uh, getting hold of me and trying to talk to me about it. And yeah.
I was thinking of having another one after this one up there, but I don't think so. We, okay. we, we're moved on. We, we're moved on. We're, we're in the Auckland one now, where the business is. Yeah. The business is up in Auckland from... Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. They, they know, they know, they know that they've just been ignoring us, or especially ignoring me, yeah. uh, and not taking me seriously. Uh, none of them, no, none of anybody takes me seriously. But now, now, uh, in, in some ways, it's, it's, it's a blessing for me to be ignored all the way, uh, because it left me free to do what I want, you see? Now I've got the whole internet, everybody in the world's watching what I'm putting there, and they'll say, what's wrong with your Maori people? Oh no, they're all in trouble. Eh? It doesn't look very good. Between Trump and the Maoris here, they're all in trouble. Trump's in trouble. And, and and the Queen. He's catching up with you. Okay. Okay, okay. Yeah. Just watch those fellas. <laughs> Make sure your your flags are fluttering. <laughs> Say hello. <laughs> so, yeah. Just throw them over over the top of your roof of an old newspaper that's got tikkuri on it. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, that's our good news, mate. <clears throat> I'm happy I got that now, and, and that's that's the highlight of my day. Okay. Hello, Marianne. Hello, Marianne. She's 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 going away. Oh, she's in work. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, right. okay, okay. Oh, well, we're all good. We're all good. I, I, I've had a good sleep, so I'm relieved. Okay, bye. Bye. Well, let's march. <clears throat> I've got a, I've got a phone phone coming. And all I had to do is turn it on the documents I'm working on. I'm just going to show you the document in a moment. I'm going to read it to you on this deed. I'm, I'm all about the deeds, the titles. And that's about all I went to real estate for, is to understand how real estate works. Not so much to sell billions of properties. I will, in the end, be seizing a lot of properties because of the fraud. You're going to have to pay for the fraud, this 970 million trillion trillion pound note. I'm just doing the documents today. I'm going to try and make an effort. I'll go for a walk first and stick all that together. It's all over the place, all a big mess, but it'll come out clean in the end. Anyway, I'm just saying, for Hori Chikuri, Robo, Morris Baker is very passionate about his tupuna. He's that passionate that he is starting to get a grip on things as far as the land and who's on it is concerned. Now I'm going to flip this round through because I've been going through my documents over the years. I'm going back to 2015 at least for now. And that's the one I'm talking about to Morris. That's my thing here. Big two point two two terabyte. Uh, stick the camera on that and the little GoPro there. So here we go. Here's the document I'm talking about. It has Horitakuri right there. Okay, you, see, you can read that? Kaipara district. Stretched right up north from Awador Native Magistrate Court. Okay? And here, here, is the three chiefs. Tumairangi, Nahiraka, Nahira, Nahiraka, and Manukau. You see, Manukau? Refa, Refa, Manukau. 
Okay. And here is the agents. A.S. Atkinson of Taranaki, farmer. What's he doing Taranaki up here in the Kaipara? S. Percy Smith, government surveyors, Kaipara district. Okay, Kaipara district. So they were, they were doing this deed. I'm, I'm going to read it out to you. Here it is here. There's this deed written on the 24th day of December in the year of our Lord, 1860 is a full and final sale, conveyance and surrender by us, the chiefs and people of the tribe of Wai Aruhe Te Rarawa, Te Kawe Wahie, whose names are hereunto subscribed and witnessed that of, on behalf of ourselves, our relatives and descendants, we have, by signing this deed under the shining sun of the day, parted with and forever transferred unto Queen Victoria of England, her heirs and kings and queens, who may succeed her and her and her signs, their signs, forever and in consideration of the sum of six hundred and twenty-two pounds, thirty-nine pounds, ten shillings, has previously been received by us. Pounds to us paid by Mr. Rogan, District Commissioner, on behalf of Queen Victoria, and we paid by Mr. Rogan, when we paid by Mr. Rogan, District Commander, on behalf of Queen Victoria, and we hereby acknowledge the receipt of the said monies, all that piece of our land situated hereby, situated at Kaipara, and named Tikuri. The boundaries whereof are set forth at the foot of this deed and the plan of which land is annexed thereto with its trees, minerals, waters, rivers, lakes, streams and all appertaining to the said land or beneath the surface of the said land and all our right, title, claim and interest whatsoever, who, whatsoever to hold to Queen Victoria her heirs and her signs as a lasting possession absolutely forever and ever. So I'm just saying, with all of this going on, this was done in Australia. Okay? The, uh, the irony here of it is that the Australians are trying to claim that it's their title. And the British are saying, no, you haven't got a license. Because they had... Um, um, assumed the sovereignty of Queen Victoria through Australia as second hand and as um, 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 a government, um, what do you call it, a government um, in waiting or a de facto government, de facto, something like that. So here, here's the Kuri right there. I just want to show you on this video, page 217, Kaipara District, 1860, Deeds 165, Tikuri Block, Kaipara District. This is just one block. I'm, I'm just talking about the dates and the block and the method of selling land. Okay? Uh, that's in Māori there, but I see it in English. Um, but. Um, uh, this is the tricky part about this is there the, the, uh, is, is this Mui Manikau told me that Refere for Manikau was captured this one here Refere for Manikau was captured why the hell didn't they put their names in full instead of just half a bit here and there that was this is the discrepancy in these titles I've been reading other 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 bits of of information uh, here, I'll, I'll just go to it afterwards. Um, about who who had the authority to be licensed to sell land, buy and sell land. So they're saying on behalf of Queen Victoria, but saying the New South Wales owns the titles. No, they don't. Not as far as I'm concerned. And so I've got I put these here, there, here, this bit here. This bit here comes out of this here, 
right? All this here of this is a The Knights of England, a complete record, I'm, I'm, I'm stretching it out. The Knights of England, a complete record from the earliest time to the present day of Knights of all the orders of chivalry uh, in England, Scotland and Ireland, and of Knights Bachelors incorporating a complete list of Knights Bachelors dubbed in Ireland. Dubbed in Ireland. Now, that's, that's where I'm going. Ireland, in Belfast, um, um, St. Patrick's Order there, and the Rogans and the um, Cosgroves, and the Rogans are tied right there, the Knights of England, the Knights of England. And so this is where I'm taking all this, there's quite a lot of pages here, I've been going through it on the years, at least on the years, that's 1890, I've gone back to the year, not 1500, 1820s, where King George, and King George, the fourth and Tera Waikato Whare Here Manukau. They have hidden, they have deliberately hidden Tera Waikato Whare Here Here Manukau and Refere for Manukau's history. They have hidden it and inserted their own. So that's the part I'm going to throw them out. I'm going, I'm going to throw them out as the surrogate of those Manukau's. I'm speaking for the Manukau's and the Wanos, the Rogans of that era, because. Those three names put some titles together. At the East Coast, the Rogans there, and the, and, and, um, the Kaipara, the Rogans there, and the Manukau's. The Rogans and Wainua's down the East Cape, and the Rogans and the Manukau's in Kaipara, with those Kaipara titles. Now you can see the titles have stretched all the way up Te Rarua, up north, and um, back here, right here. All Englishmen have being bred in the belief, belief, in the belief, that questions of promotion and of precedence are decided entirely by the date of gazetting. It was a rude shock to this belief to find that for more than 50 years of the history of the Order of St. Michael and St. George, the dates of the warrants and appointments as contained in the register never agree, never agree with the dates of Gazetting. In some cases there is a difference even of months. There can surely be no doubt that if the Gazette does not agree with the warrant of appointment, then the Gazette is wrong. The warrant of the appointment is decisive and final authority. So far as I have been able to trace this matter, the superstition with regard to the London Gazette has originated in the War Office as army promotions and decorations are so closely connected. It is very convenient, convenient to have a single rule applicable to both and to count both the one and the other from the date of gazetting. But it is illogical and historically very confusing and deplorable that this rule has ever adopted, been adopted by this War Office as a mere matter of convenience, should by implication have been extended to other orders quite differently circumstanced. That's what I'm saying. I'm challenging the gazetting and the appointment of Rogan from Australia and not directly from Britain. They are... <coughs> um, um, they are a de uh, jure or, or, or a government uh, at a distance. They are not a government here operating because there was no sovereignty here then at the time. Okay, that's what I'm saying. They are mischievous. Those are all the thugs there that I'm heading off. These are the present ones in government, these ones here. This one here had a big failure, right? And and this one here had a big failure. This one here had a big failure. They are all failures, right? These ones over here will fail. This one failed. This one here is this one is going to be dropping. This one here was the biggest failure from down at Rotorua, down that area, Te Uruo Flavel. 
you see? Ururo, he pinched that name Ururo from the chiefs up north. See, they're, they're mischievous these guys. So I'm saying to these people on this video, you lot, you've got this pound note on your head with Ernest Augustus right here. There, you've got Ernest Augustus, Rainy Monarch, King of Britain, UK, Hanover. And 970 million trillion trillion pound note. He's our partner. He's our monarch. Oath of office. You've got any assumptions? You lot have got no seal of Westminster Parliament. No seal of the Queen. In fact, you have no licence to be operating your government here. So you're getting this from me. You're getting this from me. Right? You've already got this bill on your heads, all of you, and your queen. Your humbug queen and your humbug whakapapa, your humbug iwi Maori trust. You've got caught out with Peter Paroni and the Waitangi National Trust. I'm looking at this photo. I'm, I'm accusing you lot now. Jacinda Ardern. Tilda Dada Flavel. I don't know what this fellow's name is. I've forgotten. Winston Peters. Bill English. That's the um, I, I forgot what his name. Uh, Bennett, Paula Bennett, uh, Davis, Calvin Davis, Marama, uh, um, what's her name? Uh, and Jacinda Ardern. All right? You're getting this bill. But well, you already got it. You're, you're already got, I'm, I'm telling the whole world, this is your bill. This is your bill. If you can't prove to me, where's your seal? Where's your seal from Britain, UK? Where's your seal from the Queen? And where's your authority from? And where's your flag authority from? You try to get rid of the flag and put a fern there, and steal, steal the fern of our indigenous Te Kuri and Referef Manukau land, right? I've just showed you the titles. And you have obliterated them. You thugs, you pirates, you thugs have obliterated Te Kuri and Referefa Manukau and Te Rawaikato Wharehereher in Manukau from our history. Now, what are you going to say about that? The Hui or the hearing, the Native Land Court Magistrate Court hearing is on the 26th of January 2018 at Te Waka Marae Native Magistrate Court in Epsom at 10 o'clock. You thugs have to turn up. If you don't turn up, this is apostolized against you. Okay? This 970 million trillion trillion pound note is apostolized against you, people. I just want to show you the other one, but if I can find it, if not, right oh, here. This one. This one. 970 million trillion trillion pound note, right? This is green for Ireland and green for St. Patrick's Order, the Moai, Gold, Dragon, the Bill, you buggers, Hanover, Scotland, Ireland, and England, Northern Ireland, and Jamie and I. Jamie, Patrick. The name Patrick goes with the green in Ireland, but I'm putting, I'm putting Venice Augustus in, our, in her place and my place here with this one. I'm apostolizing this. As you can see, I've just got the back cover. Oh, somewhere. I've got the, black, the plastic to go in the front. I'm, I'm apostolizing this on its own. I'm apostolizing with, with the plastic cover. Place the cover here and the back cover. So the back, back cover here. Over here. The back cover. So this is one apostoly. This is one apostoly that goes together like that. Okay, and I'll bind it up on the machine around there. So that's one. We're going to apostolize that one with Jamie and I for here in New Zealand. And apostolize that one. 
green, green. I've got to replace um, King Arthur with King George IV. I've still got to change that on the pound note and put King George there with King George the Fourth and King William the Fourth and Earth Augustus. Okay, and I'll put King George, King William the Third in there as well on the pound note. So against you lot and your Queen, Trump, uh, the Rothschild Banks, the United Nations, EU Parliament, um, IMF, uh, Church of State, Church of England, Catholic Church, in fact all the churches who have used this flag for other reasons. You can see those 8 point stars in the four corners of the earth? Well that's what this green means, the St. Patrick is those eight point stars in the four corners of the earth to the green, not the orange. The orange, the, the king of orange is King William III, but he's not St. Patrick. The, the orange is King King William III, creator of the Bank of England and the pound note, creator of these pound notes. We have the license, the license to use them, okay, on you, debtors. Judgment debtors that I just showed you on the computer. Okay, so that's really what I wanted to show you uh, uh, today. It, it's hot. Uh, that's why I don't like wearing clothes. Uh, I just wear the same one all the time. Uh, Mark Zuckerberg, uh, the, the owner of Facebook, he, he wears the same shirt all the time. Same one. So I'm no different to him. He, he's a geek. He might call me a geek, but I'm telling you. I'm doing more than just a geek. Um, I just wanted to show you a couple of other things while we're here. So I'll just show you my documents of what I've been doing for a long, long time. It's just documents. So that's that main one there, 165 with Kuri. And then you've got the other ones. Um, I'll go back to my folder, Refere for Monaco here, and have a look at the other. Now, now I'm going to show you something. I'm, I'm going to show you people up there in Napoli. What's wrong with this Papa? Right? Here is Tera Wakato Fari Hiri Hiri Manaka of Mangatotari Mountain in Karapiro, Arapuni and Kihiki area. Tira Waikato is a woman married to Mahanga, first Tane, Ripo, Ripiro, second Tane, and out of that goes into the next page. Oh, where's that gone? Oh, I've got I've got to go to another page, but it strings off into Te Uruiaho and Te Rorua, Ngāti Kahu, Ngāti Kawa, out of this crooked whakapapa. Now, somebody's got to explain to me who is that woman, who is that woman and where did it come from. You'll find it's going gonna, it's gonna to blow your brains right out. It's going to blow your brains right out because it's false, fake and corruption.